river bike access. So what do you think? Hi everybody, my name is Javier, Program Director with Bike San Gabriel Valley. Uh, welcome to the El Monte bus station and the brand new bicycle and pedestrian access point to the biggest bus station west of the Mississippi. So this is entirely brand new, it just opened up yesterday and we hope that you out there that live in the community can actually start using it now to safely access the El Monte bus station. Come on down and check it out. So as you can see, the Almani bus station and the bus terminal is, are actually right behind me. We have a nice little walkway that leads you right here, but as you can see, you do have to cross the street here uh, where they've in included some continental crosswalks, make it a little bit more visible. And if you take a notice right here, we have a designated space uh, here along this shared road, and this here is a Shero uh, signage that we've been on the street. So what do you guys think? Biggest bus station west of the Mississippi here in Almani. Amazing facility, it's gold LEED certified, which just means it's a leader in environmental and energy design. We now have amazing access to one of bicycle super highway that travels north, south from uh, uh, the San Gabriel River, I'm sorry, the uh, Rio Honda River, um, that practically takes you all the way down to the Pacific Ocean. But here, we have the Almani Bike Hub. As you can see, it's currently vacant. This is uh, definitely a type of facility that we can envision as being not only a high capacity parking facility, but also a resource center for people to actually come, utilize, uh, have staff people or people on staff working uh, around the clock to provide various types of bicycle services, whether it's bicycle mechanics, bicycle education, um, resource center where you can get bicycle maps to get to and from uh, the area. Now that we're working on a regional bike master plan, definitely something that could fit into that plan. Um, but anyhow, we would hope to see this uh, eventually become some type of uh, all-in-one resource center for bicyclists throughout the San Gabriel Valley and in LA County. So hopefully one day that'll come to fruition. But for now,